swimming in space, swimming in space, swimming in space. Hey guys, Eric here from Cheap Ass Reviews, and this week we're going to be talking about the air flosser made for TV in space. So yeah, let's do that. <laughs> As you guys know, I only review stuff in space if I would never use them back on Earth. The as seen on TV, Power Floss, Dental Water Jet certainly fits that description. It was a gift from a friend that works at a mail order company, and though I'm certain he had his best intentions give me this gift, it sat on my shelf covered in cobwebs for over a year. Why? Well, when I went to see my dental hygienist, she told me I'd be an idiot if I thought an air flosser would work as well as the real thing. That seemed a little harsh, but I listened. Until I got braces. Well, why the hell did you get braces, Eric? Let me tell you, every single time I bit down, one of my top teeth would wiggle. And not like the four dudes on that children's show, like in the bad way. So I slapped some braces on there. Side effect, uh, I look awful and I can't floss easily. Since my patent is still pending for lithium ion floss, this seemed like the only viable option. Actually, I checked and someone already had a similar patent. Uh, Link in the description if you're own hombre curioso. So yeah, I thought, what the hell, I'll try it out. I'll give it a whirl, and I hated it. It's a cheap piece of piece. I even took it to the Martian surface and I filled it up to the fill line, and that didn't do that good of a job for me. Then again, I was using a mold of my teeth. And I'm just gonna end the review here because I hate this thing, but if you wanna buy one, there's a link to the Amazon page in the description, so check it out. And thanks Jim Bob for the air flosser. Wow, that's awesome. Like me floating. Hey guys, check this out. It has a plastic button, which is plastic. 